Welcome back again guys to another wonderful section with me. I am Richard Semeru from VSL Concept YouTube channel. I am super excited because in today's video I'll be showing you exactly how Google Ads work. Have you ever wondered how businesses get their ads to show up on the top of Google's search result pages? Guys, all thanks to Google Ads. Google Ads is basically an advertising platform that allows businesses to create and display ads to potential customers on Google search engine results pages and other of Google properties. Guys, you do well want to watch this video and pay attention to this video from beginning to the end because at the end of this video, I have a riddle question that I'll be asking in this video. And if you get that riddle question correctly, guys, you stand a chance to win a very, very wonderful prize from us at the end of this video. Please, it is very important that you take this lesson very, very serious because understanding the mechanism behind Google Ads, knowing how it works, is one pro tip that would help you spend less on your ads campaign. Yes, you will reduce your advertising cost by 30% because you know how the Google Ads work. So the big question is this, how does Google Ads work? Google Ads is actually a pay-per-click advertising system that allows you to display your ads on Google search engine result pages and other Google-owned properties. We'll talk more about that later on in this video. Yes, I mentioned pay-per-click at the beginning. What does that mean? It means that you only pay when someone clicks on your ad on Google. So imagine that you have 1,000 persons who have seen your ad you will not pay until someone clicks on it. So out of these 1,000 persons you have, just 10 persons who have clicked on this ad, you are going to pay for only those 10 clicks. So that is what it meant by pay per click. Now, here is how the system works. For you to actually run ads on Google, the very first step is to create your Google Ads account. Now, here is a preview of what the Google Ads account looks like. As you can see on your screen, you see a preview, an overview. Guys, this is where the magic happens. But we'll talk more about this later, later, later on and we'll see exactly how you can set up this Google Ads account and how you can actually have your ads up and running. After getting your Google Ads account set up and you can see your dashboard, the next thing that you need to do is to choose the keywords that you want to target with your ads. You might wonder, what are keywords? How does keywords work? Now, these keywords are words and phrases of words that potential customers are likely to use when searching for products that are related to the service that you actually offer. Here's an example. Let's imagine that you live in Lekki, Lagos State in Nigeria and you need a plumber to come fix a broken tap. You head on to Google and then you search for plumbers in Lekki. You hit enter. Now this group of words that you have entered in this search bar is what we refer to as what? Keywords. So what your potential customer is searching for is what we refer to as what? The keyword. So if I actually want to get a ring light and I say ring lights in Lagos, what is my keyword? This ring light in Lagos, what I have just typed here is what my keyword. So if I want to learn digital marketing and I come over to Google and I search for what digital marketing training in Lagos, automatically this set of words that I have just typed is my what keyword. So identifying the keywords that you actually want to rank for when running your ads is very, very important because on Google ads, it is keywords that you rank for. So the idea is you think of keywords that people will search for, your potential customers search for, that's actually what you rank for on Google Ads. So after getting your keywords, you will now create an ad that will be displayed to users when they search for those targeted keywords. But you will agree with me, there will be so many competitors who run same ads at the same time. Now, how does Google know which ads to display to the user who have put in that keyword at a particular time? 
Yes, Google does this through a bidding system. Google have actually designed their system in a way that when you are creating your ad, you'll be able to put in your bid amount. So that amount is actually the highest amount that you are willing to pay per click for each of those keywords that you are ranking for. So let's say we have three plumbers who want to rank for the keyword plumbers in Lekki. We are saying that Google is giving these three different plumbers the options for them to put in. I'm offering this amount per click. I'm offering this amount per click. I'm offering this amount per click. So let's say that plumber one offers to pay one dollar per click. And plumber two offers to pay two dollar per click. And then plumber three, who is the big man, come and say, no, I am offering to pay you ten dollar per click. With this price bidding system, naturally, Google should give this space to this plumber number three. Why? Because he is what? The highest bidder. Well, I'm sure you know that the system will not be free and fair that way. The big sharks, those big men as it were, who have a fast budget for advertising would come into the system and they will always want to dominate for all the keywords. Google understands that. So they did not make the system that way. What did they do? So Google does not just look at the bid amount only. That's the amount you have offered to bid for a keyword. Now they look at that bid amount along with your ads quality score ads quality score so the quality score plus your bidding amount aggregates where you would appear for a particular keyword now what and what are involved in this ad quality score what makes it up yes there are so many factors that actually makes up this ad quality score we have how relevant your ad copy is to that keyword. One, we have the quality of the landing page that you are sending people to. Is it beautifully designed? Does it have all the elements of a landing page? Two, we also have the expected click-through rate. Yes, if 100% person sees the ad, is it captivating enough that 20, 30, 40 persons will click on it? All of these are the factors that makes up your what? Your quality score. So Google adds this quality score plus the amount that you have bidded. Adds them up and determines your ads position on the search result. So if Plumber One in our example who has a low bid actually works on improving his what? Quality score. What happens? You will see that he will gain that top spot as against this plumber number three who have offered to pay ten dollar per click so when a user actually search for one of these target keywords google ads auction system determines which ads to display based on the bid amount and also the quality score so the ads are actually displayed at the top and also at the bottom of the search result page and also on other Google-owned properties such as YouTube and Google Display Network. We'll talk more about this in subsequent videos that would come up. Guys, now you know how Google Ads work. Do you appreciate the wonderful information I have given to you about how Google Ads works? All you need to do to show appreciation is hit the subscribe button hit the like button and share this video share this video so so many other persons will benefit from this mind-blowing information that we have just passed you now know how google ad work do you want to learn how to professionally create ads on google where you'll be able to spend very very low here i present to you a complete comprehensive google ad course Yes, in this course, I will not just show you how to run these ads. I will hold you here, show you step by step, practically, how to publish your first ads professionally in a way that you spend very, very low. Remember I mentioned the importance of your quality score being very, very high. So you can bid low, 
and your ads still appear on the first page. I'll be showing you exactly in that course. This course also features amazing secrets that professionals in this niche use to do what? Maximize results with Google Ads. Guys, I am super super excited about this course because it is exactly what you need for you to do what? To make sales of that service or product that you are trying to promote. Check the link in the description below. I have dropped a link on how you can access this mind-blowing Google Ad course now at a very, very special discounted rate. Make sure you subscribe to this channel, turn on post notifications so you can get notified when next I will drop an amazing video that will blow your mind. And now to our wonderful riddle of this video that I mentioned at the beginning of this video. I said I was going to drop a riddle question that I have given answers to already in this video. The riddle question is this. When was the last time in this video that I dropped this keyword, plumbers in Lekki? When was the last time that keyword displayed in this video? Yes. I popped up that keyword several times in this video. If you are able to tell me the last time when that keyword dropped, you stand a chance to win this massive Google Ads course that is worth $100. So what are you waiting for? Go back through the video and look out for that last time when that keyword dropped. Do not forget to subscribe to this channel turn on post notifications and share this video so so many other persons can benefit from this wonderful information that you have just gotten right here for free. Some mind-blowing videos will pop up on your screen right now. Do well to watch those video because it is taking you one step closer to you making money on the internet and also growing your business with mind-blowing tips. I can't wait but to see you in our next video.